On Monday, March 25, 2024, the outgoing president, Macky Sall, went to Twitter to congratulate his opponent, Basil Diomaifai, on his election on Sunday, March 24. A historic first round victory that amounts a political earthquake, Macky Sall has not been a candidate for re election after being elected and re elected in 2012 and 2019. Basiru Dumaifai, who was still in prison 10 days ago and turned 44 on Monday, has never held national office. He will be the fifth and the youngest president of the West African country with a population of 18 million people. This is the first time in the 12 presidential elections that have been held by universal suffrage that an opposition candidate won in the first round. What makes this event all the more remarkable is that the victories expected to be far-reaching apparently motivated by a desire to change, if not, break with the past after years of hardship. According to El Haji Mamadoum Baye, a teacher and researcher at the University of St. Louis, people are thirsty for change when they see what is happening in the country in terms of corruption, disrespect of law, and the person who most embodies this change is Usman Sonko. Basil Dumaifai was widely expected to win the Sunday's election, but his victory was still subject to recognition by the government candidate, Amadou Ba, in the absence of official publication of aggregated results, which would take a few more days. After three years of upheaval and crisis, the Senegalese now know the name of the next head of state after voting between continuity and perhaps radical change. According to those involved, voting proceeded without any major incident. This is the third time Senegal has changed hands at the ballot box since independence from French in 1960, when a series of coups installed military regimes in neighboring countries and postponed elections indefinitely, despite tensions in recent years and the last-minute postponements.